We come to Falmouth, land of beautiful baby goats. Next. <laughs> Capecast. <laughs> so Donna, tell us about your beautiful life with goats. I've been raising goats since 1979 and my husband and I show them and raise them. We sell goat's milk and goats, and we just absolutely love them and adore them. Right now is our prime kidding season. We have anywhere from eight to 10 kids up to upwards of 20 or so. Some of them are young and being nibbled yeah. by some beautiful goats. Yeah. What's their story here? Th this breed is called La Mancha. This breed is the only breed of dairy goat that originated here in the United States and they've become very, very popular. They have very short ears. They are not cut or cropped. They are born this way. So Donna, we saw a tattoo procedure. What yeah. was that all about? Uh, the girl came over. She bought goats for me last year, and one of her goats that she bought for me kitted, and she wanted to get it tattooed because she's planning on showing this year. I'm helping her show. Um, and they have to be, be tattooed, they have to have some sort of identification and it goes on the papers. This is Symphony, she's yep. seven weeks old. She is. And she just got tattooed. She did. And what does that mean for you? Um, that means that we can show her. She's our first La Mancha's that we've had at Smithfield Farm um, from our first kidding this season. So we're really excited and we're going to show her at Barnesville County Fair this year. So. Hi, baby. Now, if you boil it all down, what is the simple joy of owning a goat? Just that they, they don't care at the end of the day about other things going on. They just love you for you. doesn't matter. You know, that's all. It just doesn't matter. They just love you. We have a three-week-old goat right here. Feeling good. Getting to know each other. You are so beautiful. Little kiss. Oh, best in show. That's Mojito. Oh, my Mojito. I'm in love. <laughs> 